Hello, Venom's here. Come on, Ruadi. I'm from the Mirta, Egypt. It's great to meet all of you. Well, today we are going to talk all about assumption people with high IQs are good language learners. All right. I'm going to try and make this video straight to the point because I disagree with the assumption because language learning is not only evaluated with one's knowledge about grammar rules or items of language believed uh, to be tested quantitatively. So, first of all, I'm going to define the IQ term. So, the IQ term is, stands for intelligence quotient. The score derived from one of several standardized tested to assess an individual's intelligence. IQ tests are designed to measure general ability in solving problems and understanding concept by testing spatial mathematical language and memory abilities. Secondly, in fact, language learning uh, gives emphasis on the oral communication skills of learner which can't be measured in a test uh, of IQ. If people are interested in learning something like foreign languages and its items, they can be successful as a good language learner. As far as I see and experience these people who are successful in language learning are the social and in entertaining people that is not a characteristic which cannot be measured in IQ test. For example, Francis Goen, who is a smart college professor who failed to learn the German language using his own techniques. His failure reiterated the idea that practice is an important part of language learning and that simple memorization is not sufficient. Finally, to summarize, I disagree with assumption because people with high IQs may not be good learning language learners. Thanks a lot for watching and see you soon.